Prime Minister Ranil Wickremesinghe had written a letter to the General Secretary of Parliament that the former chairman of the Committee on Public Enterprises, D.E.W. Gunasekhar, had violated parliamentary privileges when looking into the central bank bond transaction. At a special media briefing today, the Premier elaborated. After the committee report was put forward to uh, Parliament, what did we do? I said, we can debate it, that I am the minister in charge. And I wanted the committee also to be summoned. So, uh, this matter was taken up in the committee. There was no decision taken. Though the chairman, then chairman was against it. The committee members, for even if the committee turned it down, I appealed to parliament to give me a chance to go before the committee. So, uh, Mr. Diogun has taken a statement with saying that there was no need for me to come. is incorrect, wrong, false. He has no power to decide. And the committee was more than willing to have me. Once parliament is dissolved, they cease to be members. Only the speaker, the legal official and the prime minister uh, function. That's because two of, it, two of them because the 19th amendment. As a result, no one else has the authority to act on behalf of parliament or release reports of parliament. So what Duguna Sekar has done is a violation and a contravention of section 22 of the parliamentary powers and privileges act. And any report from that is also contravention and is in no way covered by privilege in publication. When the new parliament meets, we'll ask, we'll ask the committee, select committee to continue with the same members and others, whoever, same members are elected and other members, and three months to go into this and all the other uh, frauds in the central bank and we report the country will know what has happened to the monies of the people. When news was made inquiries from the former chairman of the COP, Dev Gunasekara, on the matter, he refused to comment and added that he would convene a media briefing in the future and respond to the allegations levelled.